Hi, my name is Sisonke, Sisonke Msimang, and I'm a South African writer. I've written a book called Always Another Country, which is a memoir of growing up in exile, so many different countries, and eventually finding my way home uh, when Nelson Mandela was released from jail. Um, and so it's a story that is very much about belonging um, and searching and looking for your identity and trying to find a place in this world. Um, I wrote it for a couple of reasons. Firstly, because I'm a storyteller and so I, I wanted to tell some stories. But also importantly, because um, there are many, many important African stories um, about surviving the most extraordinary hardships. Genocide, female genital mutilation, uh, being a child soldier. These are crucial stories. Um, but I wanted to write my own story, which is completely different from that, which is um, an ordinary kid whose parents and the community around her had big dreams and ambitions, striving, education. And this is a story, I think, not just of many Africans, but of many migrants, of many people around the world. Um, so I wanted to give voice to that, to ordinariness, to tiny little stories, um, to falling in love, to having a broken heart, to fighting with your friends, to making up again, um, to all of those things that make us human, um, and to say that this is also Africa. Um, and of course, of falling out of love with my own country, South Africa. And of course, it's a never ending sort of push and pull. I love it very much as well. So it's a story about many things, but above all, I think it's a story that many people can relate to no matter where they are from and no matter where they are in the world. And so I hope people read it and I hope people um, think about it as something important and special. Thank you.